parachutes travel down and forward, our observational position is constantly changing. We perceive this motion as a radial optic flow pattern. Forward movement causes an expanding pattern, whereas backward movement results in a contracting pattern. Your trajectory, or the termination of your glide slope, shows no movement, whereas objects seen in your periphery move at great speed. We can use this visual trick to determine our heading and gauge the distance we will be able to navigate with the altitude we have remaining. Imagine taking a ride at warp speed on board the Starship Enterprise. As the ship accelerates, we can see stars streak across the screen in a loud expanding direction. However, there's a point in the middle of the screen that appears not to move and remains quiet. This is where the Enterprise is heading. As you travel through the air, objects on the ground such as plants and buildings will remain stationary. However, these objects will appear to move at different speeds relative to you. If the objects are moving fast or down in your visual field, that means you will be flying over or past them. If they appear to be moving away from you, or in this case up in your visual field, you will not reach that particular target. One of the major issues of trying to locate this visual cue is that we directly influence the quiet spot with our canopy's controls. Jumpers should maintain a straight course and remain in one continuous flight mode. This way, they can train their eyes to start taking note of the subtle visual changes as their position of observation changes.